Welcome back, everybody, to Mitchell Bulliani RC or MBRC. Got a short video for today. Gonna be going over the Gunner RC Snowplow. This thing is super cool. It's awesome. I love it. I've been out plowing with it. I've done some shorts with it. So today I'm gonna do a short video on the details. Gonna go over its functionality, how you can run it on your SCX24, and where you can get it. So stay tuned and let's hit the table. Hey, here we are, guys, at the table. Here's that beautiful Gunner's RC Garage Plow. Super awesome detail. He does a really nice job printing these up and putting them together. You know, the snow foil is a little bit flexible, replaceable cutting edge, plow markers. Even goes ahead and touches some paint on it. You got nice scale chains there. Really well put together unit. Bolts into there like your bumper. It's got a servo and lights. So it is functional, it goes up and down. You got lights there, it's really cool. I am running this on my Mega Bronco or AKA Plow Guy truck. Uh, it's a Mega Bronco when I take the plow off, obviously. As you can see here, it's pretty simple. You plug the lights into LED there. Um, still got the lights in the Bronco working too. And then the plow gets plugged into the auxiliary port, which is actually channel three on the controller. I'll show you up here. You got your channel three right here. So it's not an intermittent control. You got all the way down or back drag as I like to call it. You got like a float halfway up if you set the plow that way. And you got all the way up for road travel as I like to call it. So super awesome little plow. Super awesome little plow. Uh, this is a small business guys so I will give you guys all the information on how to get a hold of Sean and how to get yourself one. Uh, there will be a wait time on it because, you know, he, he's going to get slammed with orders, I'm sure. It's winter time and everybody seems to think this thing is awesome. And it is. Don't mind that little project there. That's going to be a CR18P Slayer. OG Slayer. And <laughs> that's going to be a cool build when I get it finished. But today's focus was on this. So I'll give me a minute. I'm going to put a battery in it and fire it up for you guys so you can see it in action a little bit. And I do have some run action from the other day of it plowing snow. Pretty awesome. All right, guys, here we are all powered on. Now, I got it uh, raised all the way up. Now, with your other SCX24s, this is going to fit a lot better. Mr. Mega Bronco here, uh, he's pretty tall for the plow. So I had to do some things to adjust that so the functionality was proper. Um, you can see when I dropped the plow halfway. Oh, that's all the way. That's halfway. So that's kind of a float area. You know, it's able to pick up and move around. Um, the way I have it set too is if I'm pushing too hard, it actually pushes back into the servo. Actually kind of like that because uh, not all the force is being put down here on the lower uh, lower frame. So, you got all the way down, all the way up. Now, when I had this on a smaller truck, I was able to raise the plow up really high, you know, get that middle section there to adjust nicely. Um, but yeah, super awesome. Now, this guy's running a 370 can with all the lights, the plow, and you're running it. It does tend to kill the battery pretty fast with those, you know, axial 2S batteries. But overall, super awesome. Super awesome. You could almost say it's absolutely epic. <laughs> so, right on, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this little review of it. Well, you know what? guess it can get into some details. You got a little Metal Gear servo, MG9OS. They're um, nice little servos. So far I have no issues with that. Uh, you could actually probably upgrade that if you wanted in the future, but uh, why bother if it functions? So I'm going to leave it at that. Enough waffling. I'm going to pull up some footage of this thing plowing snow. If this is something you guys enjoyed, please like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos like what's going to go on with that guy. And uh, in the future, I have some other fun stuff coming up. So, yeah, let's get to the action. Oh, yeah, right in the middle of the video. Mail call. 
It's from Josh over at Texoma. Let's see what we got in here. All right. Oh, cool. Orange and black. That's going to look freaking awesome. Very cool. Very, very cool. All right, guys. Ooh, and a sticker. Right on, man. This is going to be awesome. We're going to be using some of this in that build, maybe? I don't know. We'll figure it out. Right on. All right, guys. I don't know what happened to my footage from the other night. I had some, so I recorded just some new stuff. <laughs> it's not as good, but you get to see the plow in action, and you kind of see it go through a durability test unintentionally. But here we go. Let's hit it. <laughs> I guess I shouldn't have backed it down. Packing that down didn't work. Let's try this a little bit. All right, and you can see my plow digging in a little bit here. It's basically because I changed the angle of things, so it's catching a little bit, and the cutting edge is brand new. But I'll leave you a little music and some plowing action. Hope you guys enjoyed. Ready UFO? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Time.